So yeah, after Anzac Day, we had uh, cadet, uh, cadets go on the Hey guys, it's me Tazzy and welcome back to the 8th episode of a vlog of a VC student. Now, as you might be able to tell, I'm sick. <laughs> Which is brilliant. Um, not really. So, the last two weeks have been, they've been pretty good, like, apart from the last couple of days, because uh, the congestion is so clear. But, they've been pretty good. I've, um, I've had general homework, lots and lots of homework, I mean sacks and that sort of stuff. Actually, I think I've only had one sack in the last two weeks, which isn't too bad. And that was my first math sack. And that was on, um, like, stem plots and logging and that sort of stuff. It was it was pretty good. I think I did an alright job. Except for the fact that I forgot to, uh, uh, log a histogram. So, that went well. Um, we lost five or six marks there. Um, but that... Th Apart from the math sack, pretty good. The only issue was I was doing it while I was sick. So this was yesterday, this afternoon, um, and it was just, it did not feel good. My whole body was just like, stop, stop, stop. You, yuck, something's going to happen. I was sneezing the whole way through, and I felt like total crap. So that was great. Um, though, apart from that, on another note, we've been working with the social, well, I've been working with the rest of the social justice committee, and um, we went and saw the children's first retreat on, or well, last Thursday. So, for you guys who don't know, um, the children's first retreat basically brings um, children from outside of Australia and helps pay for um, real, uh, needed surgeries and that sort of stuff and medical stuff. And um, we try, we sponsor a child and raise money for them every year. We've done that for three years now, I think. So this is the third year. And this year we are fu um, fundraising for Teresa. So she, um, at a young age, she fell onto a fire and her ch and her here got fused down here. So her like her chest got fused to her neck sort of, sort of stuff, um, which isn't the greatest. So she's had lots of surgeries to, um, to, to correct this as well as the fact that her arms were fused into her side so she couldn't she couldn't raise her arms above here so she's had lots of surgeries to do that and we're just going to help with the remainder of the surgeries to uh or the payments of the surgeries for the rest of um her time in australia so basically we went up to the children's first retreat so we met uh teresa we so we also went up and met a couple of the other kids so we met ali um he's a 20 year old um who had his knees slowly encroaching so they were slowly going closer and closer and closer so he's had them straightened and uh, straightened up and he does rehab and um physio and that sort of stuff to um help with his legs and that sort of stuff uh, there was also angela can't remember what she had but she was a delightful little girl and uh so was the other one that was there as well um but basically they help with so many kids and it's so great to be able to go up there and meet the kids that we're going to be raising money for you know and there was only about uh, 12 of us who got the opportunity from a school that's 1200 kids only 12 of us got the opportunity and it was very it was very good to have that opportunity so yeah um apart from that um we've had i've had a lot of homework so a lot of last minute homework um a lot of um getting rid of getting ready for new sacks um i've got a psychology report coming up to do in a couple of weeks i've got um like I said, a couple more math sacks to do. Um, I got my two results back on my English language sacks, and they're, they're not the greatest I've passed, but the, they could have been a lot better. Um, and just in general, just um, getting through the work slowly. Um, it's, it's not easy year 12. I mean, a lot of us are like at this point in time. Um, but, you know, got to fight through. We're in week four. We've got... Um, 22 weeks left until exams sort of kick in and that sort of thing so 22 more weeks let's try and do this um apart from school um my sister came down for a couple of days from Wagga so for you guys who don't know my sister she lives in New South Wales she lives on campus in Wagga Wagga at the Charles Sturt Uni and she studies equine science so she came down for a few days and that was good um I mean me 
I mean, my sister get on like a house on fire. We do all sorts of crazy stuff and shenanigans. But um, yeah, she, it was pretty good to see her. Um, and last but not least, cadets. So cadets, it's been pretty good. You know, we've been able to um do certain things. I got a couple leadership spots on uh, Monday, so I've been reassigned to assistant section commander um under another kid who I will be helping out a little bit. I had to direct the section commanders to put together a team building activity. Um, and just oversee that. So that was, that was pretty good to do. Um, and yeah, so this is a relatively short episode, uh, mostly because I don't really want to talk. It's just, I don't feel the greatest. I'm going to go to bed early. And, um, yeah, so I hope you guys have enjoyed. Um, my name is Tazzy and I'm signing out. Peace.